10 new hybrid electric metro buses hit the road this week. The transit agency saying that their electric range will help cut emissions. As WCPO 9 News reporter Andrew Rowan shows us, it's just one of many upgrades that's giving Metro a national edge. At the Northside Transit Center, Steve White is taking advantage of his Metro Day Pass. Going home, drop the groceries off, then I'm going to the doctor. See? I'm catching the bus there. <laughs> that connectivity and convenience is picking up speed. They have more routes, more routes now going, and I've seen that. They're getting better. The wheels are going round and round on the reinventing Metro plan. It's funded by the 2020 sales tax levy of 0.8% in Hamilton County. Metro says ridership rose 32% last year. The fleet is getting upgrades too. This is one of our brand new hybrid electric vehicles that just went into service. Fully equipped with USB ports, outlets, and Wi-Fi. A lot of amenities uh, and not your usual old-fashioned bus that you would think about. While the bus is powered by fuel, the battery on the roof gives it a small, fully electric range. Metro will test geo-targeting around schools and hospitals this summer. Shut off the diesel power, shut off the gas. It goes on full electric, no emissions in that area. And then upon exiting it, it will go back to, to standard operating mode. Upgrades like this across the system are driving growth. Metro says ridership has recovered 110% since the pandemic, well above the national average of 75%. Step off the bus? And longtime riders notice the changes. What's the bus like taking it this year versus when you first moved here when all I those decades ago? Here, I think they've gotten better. The trip begins before the bus arrives. A new Northside Transit Center makes the difference for Ann Harvey. That was the highlight of Northside. It's like we're moving up. <laughs> it means a lot. It, it does. While there's room for improvement. It's just when I have to wait. How much time we got? Uh, it should be on 12:39. Four more minutes. Riders feel the rubber is meeting the road. I really enjoy catching the bus, riding around, seeing places I've never been. You know, and I like it. Andrew Rowan, WCPO 9 News.